In this problem, we've got a particle of mass 3 kilos is sliding in a straight line across a smooth horizontal surface at a speed of 40 meters per second. It encounters a rough patch of length 60 meters where the coefficient of friction between the surface and the particle is 0.25. Calculate the deceleration of the particle as it moves over the rough patch. Okay, right, so um, visually, What's happening is that we have this smooth area, okay, of floor, okay, then there's going to be this rough patch, which we know is 60 meters long, okay, and then it's smooth again, okay. So our particle, okay, is heading towards it at um, 40 meters per second. Okay, so it, and it crosses that into the um, crosses over onto the rough patch at 40 meters per second. We know that the coefficient of friction between the surface and the particle is 0.25. Okay, in that rough patch. So, if we just look at the particle on the rough patch, okay, it's got a mass of three kilos, so it's got a weight of three g it's going to have this frictional force working against it and there's the normal reaction force okay so acceleration wise although i'm writing it as acceleration going that way it is actually going to be negative isn't it okay because it's decelerating okay so that's what we want to work with so um as there is no acceleration vertically, if I resolve it vertically, then I've got the normal reaction force, take away 3g, has got to be equal to zero. So the normal reaction force is just three lots of 9.8, which is 29.4. So 29.4 newtons, that's R. Now, as we've overcome the frictional force, F is going to be equal to mu times R. So the frictional force is 0 0.25 times 29.4, which is 7.35. So the frictional force is 7.35 newtons. So if we resolve horizontally, taking to the right as positive, then the only force that's working horizontally is the frictional force, so minus 7.35. And that's got to be equal to the mass times the acceleration. So the acceleration is minus 7.35 divided by 3, which is minus 2.45 metres per second per second. So the deceleration, so deceleration is 2.45 metres per second per second, or 2.5 metres per second per second to two significant figures. Calculate the speed with which it leaves the rough patch. Well, in order to do that, we're going to have to bring in SUVAT, because we want to be decelerating at 2.45 metres per second per second. We know that the initial velocity is 40 metres per second, and we need to cover uh, 60 meters. So I want to know that final velocity. So I want the equation that doesn't have t, which is the v squared. So v squared is u squared, so 40 squared, uh, plus 2 times a times s. So 40 squared, uh, take away 2 times 2.45 times 60. So that's 1,306. So V is the square root of that, which is 36 metres per second to 2 sig fig. OK, so uh, we're coming in at 40 metres per second. And by the time we've left, gone over the rough patch 60 metres later, um, we're travelling at 36 metres per second.